Reviewing Aunt Bill's Soul Food Cafe in Katy, Texas. I have never in my life been treated so good. Customer service elite. And I was watching the whole time now. They treat everybody like that. The vibes, crazy. They was really up in here jamming. I just hope the food matched the vibes in this motherfucker. We shall see. Beef brisket hot dog. Oh man. Put you down for a second. Ooh. Man, you's a thick mom. They give you a beef weenie and they top it off with barbecue brisket and onions. Literally, when you bite into this, everything comes together and just slides in your mouth. You understand? If I had to judge this, by far, this is one of the best hot dogs I've ever had in my life. I'm just being honest. This is the fish plate with mac and cheese and cabbage. I'll turn the fish first. When I say this thing is seasoned to the gods, oh, it is seasoned to the gods. It was seasoned and breaded just right. The inside, the white meat, juicy, very tasty. Y'all know what y'all doing in that kitchen now. That's no cap. This is the cabbage. Arm sack. Arm sack for sure. Cabbage has a little bite to it. It's tangy and a little peppery. Personally, I like my cabbage to be cooked down just a little bit more to where it has that wilted, silky feel. But this ain't bad at all. <clears throat> Mac and cheese. All right, so when you try the mac and cheese, I'm just gonna just forewarn you right now. It's gonna put your ass in a chokehold. The mac and cheese is just so creamy and righteous. This ain't nothing to be played with. This is mama's cooking right here. It's mama's cooking. Let's try some of the fried chicken. Texture-wise, it's good. But when it comes to the taste, it ain't hitting no The batter definitely needs CPR. We have a plain red velvet waffle. That is really good. Let's give you some of this and a little bit of that. Ooh. I also have a waffle with piece of cobble on top. I'm gonna drizzle that mug with some syrup. Mm. That piece. Oh. Oh. That piece of cobbler, man. Ain't nothing to be played with. If I remember correctly, this is a strawberry shortcake with crumbled graham crackers. Mm. Hmm. Elite. Oh, wait. Maybe it's a strawberry pound cake with graham crumbles. When you bite into this, you're gonna taste it in this order. You taste the graham cracker first. You're gonna taste the strawberry second. And then you're gonna get molly walked by the cake. This is. It's really good. I'm gonna call this a hidden gem because not a lot of people recommend it this place. But I'm gonna put the address right here. If you're anywhere in Houston, Katy, passing through, whatever the case may be, you might want to check this place out. 